Good morning, children. This is the second part. Chapter eight, chapter three, tissue level of organization. So this is the condition of first PPT is to pseudo stratified epithelial. Uh, these are generally columnar but unequal in size but multi layered. At, but nuclei is present at the different level in different cell. And uh, uh, the general function of the uh, uh, pseudo stratified protection, secretion, absorption. Ciliated forms line the trachea and the upper respiratory tract. Non ciliated forms line the epididymis, larger ducts of glands, and, tra and tracts of male urethra. Okay. So, uh, pseudo stratified epithelia is uh, classified, it is a columnar and uh, with the different uh, nuclei is present at different level and the function is protection, absorption, secretion. There are two ciliated form, the location is different that is uh, trachea to upper respiratory tract, uh, non ciliated epididymis, larger ducts of glands, tra tracts of male urethra. So, this is called pseudo stratified ciliated columnar epithelium. Ciliated also there, non ciliated also there. Both are also given as a picture. Cuboidal or columnar cells get specialized for secretion and are called glandular epithelium. So, there are two types unicellular consisting of isolated glandular cells, goblet cells of the alimentary canal. Both are unicellular and isolated glandular cell and goblet cell. And multicellular also in another type, cluster of cells that is called salivary gland. So, these are two types. So, glands are divided into two categories, exocrine and endocrine. Exocrine glands secrete mucus, saliva, earwax, oil, milk, digestive enzyme and other cell products. So, exocrine glands are generally they are secreting mucus, saliva, earwax, oil, milk, digestive sebum. So, uh, uh, these are duct glands. So, their products are released through the duct. Then endocrine glands, this is one type, do not have duct. Their secretions are called hormones directly poured in the so, uh, this is the example for endocrine and this is the example for exocrine. Glandular epithelium divided into two endocrine, exocrine. Exocrine is divided into unicellular and multicellular. Based on structure, unicellular example, um, already we have studied uh, goblet cells and all and multicellular when the tubular alveolar, tubio alveolar, secretory unit la main arco. And then mode of secretion, uh, mirocrine, holocrine, apocrine. Secretion of chi in the monoma, three. three tissue level of organization. So, this is the condition of first PPT is to pseudo stratified epithelial. Uh, these are generally columnar but unequal in size but multi layered. But nuclei is compound epithelium. It is made of more than one layered multi layer of cells. Thus, has a limited role in secretion and absorption. Four types of compound epithelium stratified squamous, cuboidal epithelium, columnar epithelium, transitional epithelium. So, stratified squamous epithelium is two types, keratinized which forms the dry epidermis of the skin, non keratinized. If on the palm, and uh, foot layer on the keratinized. Non keratinized type forms the moist lining of the esophagus, mouth, conjunctive of the eyes and vagina. Always they are wet. That is non keratinized type. Cuboidal or columnar cells get specialized for secretion and are called glandular epithelium. So there are two types. Unicellular consisting of isolated glandular cells, goblet cells of the alimentary. Al so, uh, this is the example for endocrine and this is the example for exocrine.
So this is the picture of transitional epithelium multi-layered. Chapter 3 tissue level of organization. So this is the condition of first PPT is to pseudo stratified epithelial. Uh, these are generally columnar but unequal in size but multi-layered but nuclei is present at the different level in different cell and uh, the general function of the uh, pseudo stratified protection secretion absorption ciliated forms line the trachea and the upper respiratory tract non ciliated forms line the epididymis larger ducts of glands and, tra and tracts of male urethra Okay. So, uh, pseudo stratified epithelia is uh, classified, it is a columnar and uh, with the different uh, nuclei is present at different level and the function is protection, absorption, secretion. There are two ciliated form, the location is different that is uh, trachea to upper respiratory tract, uh, non ciliated epididymis, larger ducts of glands, tra tracts of male urethra. So, here you can see the cell junctions. This is the junction. Male is the tight junction. Kill is the tight junction. Or cell is the cementing. Adhering junction. Gap junction. Gap junction is the message. Pop. Okay. So these are some examples for cell, cell junction.